full of passengers, one from Delta, one from Southwest, stopped out on the runway, far from the terminal. Finally got a luggage cart over there now. These plane enthusiasts who routinely come out to photograph takeoffs and landings knew something was wrong. I see fire trucks of all sort, bomb squads, uh, police officers all racing down. Bobby Sedlicek grabbed his camcorder and captured this. Members of the bomb squad boarding each plane looking for possible explosives. Did you find anything? Oh, uh, we did not. The FBI says two separate bomb threats were posted on Twitter while the flights were in the air, prompting an escort from F-16 fighter jets and then an intensive search once on the ground. We start to screen the uh, aircraft. We don't let the passengers off and go through and screen the aircraft inside and below and then start conducting interviews and then uh, removing the passengers and, and then going through the luggage as well. Passengers finally got the okay to leave the planes, walking down the steps with their carry-ons. Eventually, smaller airline buses took them back to the terminal to get their checked bags. Everyone relieved that it was a false alarm. Having it happen in your hometown, this is not normal to go ahead and have fighter jets go ahead and land two aircraft with bomb threats at your airport.